Hello and welcome to my Beehive Explained video. If you're curious about what Beehive is and how it works, allow me to quickly show you. First and foremost, right off the bat, I love the fact that they do come with a free trial. I will leave a link in the description should you actually want to try it yourself. Their free plan is full of a lot of great features. And as you can see right here, the newsletter platform built for growth. This is an email marketing platform. And what I really like it about it the most is that it specifically focuses on newsletters. It doesn't have all of these other options for like webinars and super sales funnels. It strictly focuses on that. And I think that's a very powerful thing because they get to focus on just strictly being a fantastic newsletter platform. And I think they really are. Aside from that, they come with a lot of capabilities and little features and you know gadgets and gizmos when it comes to building that newsletter. For example, when it comes to creating your newsletters itself, it's cool because you can create templates. So what I did is go in here and I created one based upon some tutorials myself, which I will do for you in a few videos later. As you can see, I have my logo at top. And as you can see, also aside from that is going to be some text, what we're going to be talking about. So for example, we have our headline, we have a cool little picture I came up with, a little bit more text. This is all a little bit random, right? Because what you can do is use this as a template. So anytime you want to create a newsletter, what you go in is you just, you know, change around the text here, change around the headline, the picture, the text, and you have a just template to go through. And that's going to save you a good amount of time with some hidden treasures. Maybe you want to talk about uh, anything that's going to be popular within your newsletter. We can preview it here just to give you an idea of what it's going to look like. Okay, and you can also change this around. You'll notice how like there's a little space there and maybe a little space there, a little bit more there, and this is kind of close to the top. All of that can be changed around as well. But let me show you what it's going to look like on different, like say that's the web, we have desktop, we have mobile, you know, we have email on mobile. And I think that looks pretty cool if you ask me, especially those pictures. I'm still working on fine tuning mine, but I think it looks pretty good. And as I talked about, when it comes to the specific text you use, there's going to be the ability to edit all that in a separate section. This is going to be the design lab. And as you can see, it gives you examples of kind of what everything is going to look like. So you have your headers, you have your text, you have dividers. Anytime you want to edit any of this, this is what's going to pretty much be edited in the actual templates that you create for your newsletter. So anything from background, body text, header, email header, email footer. So when it comes to body text, I have Helvetica, you know, font size, the space between, you can always lower this. So it's at 10 now, you know, and it can be much bigger, obviously, but I'm just going to keep it the way it is at 10. And anything that you want to change around that's going to be reflected in the newsletters that you create can be done here, which is pretty easy to do. When we're done, we're going to do save changes. Aside from that, there's going to be the ability to create your little websites for this. So what's helpful is that it's kind of like a squeeze page or a landing page. I haven't added too much to mine. It's pretty simple. It's pretty basic, but it's going to get the job done. When you can add your text, your subscribe button, some frequently asked questions, some testimonials, whatever it's going to be. Mine's basic at the time, but I'll show you very quickly you know, enter your email to subscribe. Down below is going to be some frequently asked questions. What's this newsletter for? Maybe how long is it going to go out? What are you going to be talking about? What are some topics? And so on and so forth. Aside from that, I think something that a lot of people are really going to like with this is that there's multiple ways to monetizing your newsletters. Aside from the fact that you can put your own products or maybe someone else's in there, there's the ability to run ads, you have subscriptions and even boosts. Now, keep in mind, a lot of these are going to be with their paid plans, but nevertheless, should you want to upgrade, these are going to be some really nice features that can help either recoup your ad spend or allow you to make money as leads come in. For example, with Boost, what can happen is that anyone, anytime someone opts into your newsletter, what's going to show up, assume you set it up correctly, is going to be the ability for others to opt into other newsletters. What happens if they're engaged, they go through and they click, you're going to get paid per lead when you do that. So it's a great way to build your newsletter build up leads. And of course, if they opt into anyone else's, you get paid for it as well. So with a lot of great ways to monetize your newsletter, I think that's something that's going to be very attractive to a lot of people who want to start their newsletter and grow it into an actual business. Nevertheless, that's a very quick overview of Beehive, what it's all about, explain quickly how it works. Of course, some of the features and perks. If you want to test it out, I will leave my link down below for the free trial. And I should also be getting a coupon code very shortly. So bear with me uh, in case you do want to upgrade. But nevertheless, I'm going to be doing plenty of tutorial videos so you can see how it works specifically with a lot of these micro features. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching. And if that helped you, please give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you in my next video.